Is Apex Legends coming to mobile? Shooting games are fun. Shooting games with a Battle Royale mode are even more fun. Shooting games with a Battle Royale mode where every character has unique abilities are the ultimate tier of fun. If you've played PUBG Mobile and ever wondered, damn, wouldn't it be great if I could have just jumped high in the sky and rained magic upon Pochingi? Well then you've come to the right place. Last week we answered the question of whether Valorant would come to mobile. This week we're gonna dive into EA's finest creations. Nope, we're not talking about Cricket 07. We're talking about Apex Legends. As Octane in the game says, ready, set, go. Apex Legends is a free-to-play FPS battle royale developed by Respawn Entertainment and published by Electronic Arts, the same guys behind Titanfall. In the game, up to 20 squads of 3 players each land on an island and look around for weapons and supplies to defeat other squads, just like any other battle royale mode. What isn't regular, however, are the 14 playable characters each with their own unique abilities. Like for example, Bangalore. Yeah, that's her real name. Bangalore has a passive ability that makes her faster when she's getting hit by bullets, a tactical ability that allows her to throw smoke grenades, and an ultimate ability that's called Rolling Thunder, which sends massive missiles towards her enemies. How cool is that? There's also a robot called Pathfinder who's basically like Spider-Man. There's a hunter called Bloodhound who can see through walls. Then there's Watson who can put up traps, just like Cypher from Valorant. And then there's Caustic, who is basically like Viper from Valorant. Damn, I'm playing too much Valorant, I guess. Moreover, mobile gaming has never seen the likes of a futuristic battle royale, and Apex Legends could be a leader in that genre. This game has stunning graphics on the PC and console, and bringing that onto the mobile will be a challenge for EA. To play with high-tech abilities at your disposal on the mobile screen will also mean cool new controls, which could be complicated. And lastly, this is EA making their big mark into the mobile esports scene. Expect them to go all guns blazing. The mobile version was announced by EA's CEO in June. We know that the game is going to arrive on both Android and iOS mobile platforms. The job postings on EA's website indicate that the mobile port has been well under development since April. Here's the catch for Indian fans. It is reported by Daniel Ehmat, an industry insider and a senior analyst at Nico Partners, that EA is using a Chinese partner to create the mobile version of the game. EA's chief financial officer said that they needed to find a partner in order to roll out the game in China. The partner has not been announced yet. But since Tencent has worked with EA in the past to develop FIFA Online 4 and Need for Speed Online, it could be them. So yeah, folks, a Chinese partner is helping EA either make or publish the futuristic battle royale. Given India and China's political tensions on the border, this could be trouble for the Indian fans. Moving on to talk about the release date. There's no official release date in the public just yet. What we know is that it was suggested at EA's earnings call that it is expected to come out somewhere in October 2020. Wait, this is October. October has started. Where's the game? There's also Apex Legends first anniversary on the 4th of February, which could also be the release date. But then there are some other sources that say that the expected release date for Apex Legends is now May 2021, thanks to the pandemic. Remember one thing, it hasn't been long since people found out that the game is in production. So expecting an early release date might just not help yet. Bringing this game to mobile will mean a revolution in how we think about battle royales, from gameplay to graphics and to controls. Which game's esport potential would you like to see next? Let us know in the comments below. If you've been enjoying our latest series on our radar, hit the subscribe button and share this video to support our channel. We're gonna go AFK for now. See you later.